George and Barbara always wanted a family. They dated in high school and eventually married years later, in May of 1982. Their first child was born November 8, 1984. They named her Elizabeth and were extremely happy to start a family together. Two years and four months later, George Michael was born on February 17, 1987. George Michael would later be nicknamed Mike. As the time went on, something didn't seem right with Mike's health. Many doctor's visits occurred, but a diagnosis had not yet been determined. When a doctor came forth with a possible explanation for Mike's symptoms, George and Barbara decided not to extend their family. However, they soon found out they were already expecting a third child. Mike was eventually diagnosed at the age of two and a half with a rare blood disorder known as polycythemia. Jason was later born on February 12, 1990. The family grew, yet constantly worried of the outcomes of treatment for Mike, especially since treatments were not certain to work, given that his disorder was so rare. Support and love always prevailed, even though worry was prevalent in the back of everyone's mind. When Mike reached high school age, even more worries occurred. Along with his blood disorder, he then began developing rare tumors. Mike underwent a series of three surgeries to remove a total of five tumors. Although these surgeries were stressful and worrisome, they went as planned and were successful. He eventually graduated from St. Mary's College with a bachelor's degree. At this point in time, Mike is currently working on his PhD in Cellular Biology at the University of Pittsburgh. He continues to have a positive outlook on life and strives to attain the utmost success in everything he pursues. The family enjoys every moment they have together and continue to make everlasting memories. The end.